It's a two block stretch that overlooks Kitts Beach and Cornwall Avenue. And now it's closed to cars and open to pedestrians. A long time coming for some. Just makes it a nicer place to go and actually hang out and be. It's like more of a place for people. Well, I think it's great for the summertime. Uh, you know, a lot of cyclists come by and customers can now, you know, walk on the road. And I think it's, it brings in quite a few more customers. The pilot project will go on until the end of summer. Too long for some businesses who say the vehicle restrictions are disrupting their work. The city says deliveries and loading is permitted weekdays until 4 p.m. and weekends from midnight to 10 a.m. This flower shop owner says deliveries need to be made outside of those off-peak hours and says his business is hurting. Personally, I feel a lot of pressure because for the past week, my sales dropped roughly 35 percent already. Another problem, confusion about where cars are supposed to go. The city has placed small concrete blocks along U Street, but some say they're not big enough as barriers. No one's following this anyway, so people are at risk because cars keep coming through. Block that off, put up tables for people to sit. There's so many things that they could have done differently. People have lots of suggestions for the city to improve the street. I'd love to see it take off. Um, and actually be utilized. I think it would be great um, and allow the businesses to expand their patios. The city says it will monitor issues throughout the pilot and is open to making changes. If successful, U Street could be car free during the summers or even year round. Yasmin Ghanaya, CBC News, Vancouver.